Response, the Whitaker family, an American family that has drawn attention for their living conditions in a rural area of West Virginia. They represent a particularly shocking example of the modern consequences of inbreeding, isolated from the rest of society for generations. The Whitakers have lived in a closed community, without the genetic diversity that is crucial for the health and well-being of any population. This isolation, along with the practice of marriages between close relatives, has led to the accumulation of serious genetic problems that profoundly affect the family members. In the Whitaker family, the effects of inbreeding are palpable and deeply tragic. Family members present a range of health problems, including significant mental delays, down to physical deformities. What is it? Some of the members have difficulties communicating verbally, while others, they exhibit behaviors and physical characteristics that are direct manifestations of inbreeding. These issues not only impact their ability to lead a normal life, but also place them in a situation of extreme vulnerability, further marginalizing them from the society in which they live. The geographical isolation of the Whittakers in a rural area of West Virginia has exacerbated these problems. Living in such a remote environment, without access to adequate medical and educational services, has perpetuated a cycle of poverty and illness that is difficult to break, and the lack of external intervention, whether in the form of social, educational. The doctor has allowed genetic conditions resulting from inbreeding to be passed down from generation to generation, exacerbating the difficulties faced by the family. This case highlights that the consequences of inbreeding are not exclusive to elites or royal families, but can severely affect any human group that remains close to the outside. Even though the Whitakers are not part of royalty or a powerful dynasty, they suffer the same devastating consequences as other historically isolated families. Inbreeding has created a legacy of suffering and marginalization that is as visible in their case as it was in the royal dynasties of Europe and Egypt. The cycle of poverty, illness, and isolation affecting the Whitakers not only underscores the importance of genetic diversity, but also highlights the need for social and medical interventions in isolated communities. The Whitaker situation is a powerful reminder that social and geographical isolation, combined with inbreeding, can have devastating effects on people's physical and mental health.